Welcome to Killer Tactics. I'm gonna every week give you a position and try to put you into the, the side of one of the players and see if you can find the correct solution, the correct sequence and moves to improve your tactical vision. Now, the first puzzle here, these are gonna be quite short and sweet. Do subscribe to my channel and like the videos, please. Please do, it's good, you know you want to. Is a game between Fabiano Caruana with the white pieces and ex Fide world champion Ruslan Ponomariov. Both incredibly strong players. Fabiano must be a little bit gutted that he was born uh, around the same timeline as Magnus Carlsen because otherwise I feel he would have been world champion. Now when you're trying to solve a tactic it's important to home in on the key elements of the position and we can see here that White's pieces in my eyes uh, are much more dangerously actively placed than Black's pieces and another key factor is what is weak around the Black King. Well it's actually the light squares when someone puts their pawns on one color square, the black squares, the opposite color squares become weak. We can also see black's pieces are kind of on the other area of the board, so they're kind of not helping, are they? So it's a brilliant and beautiful two-part tactic here. Uh, some of, I'm, I'm sure some of you won't find this. It is quite hard. It's uh, three moves long, really, but they're very strange moves, and I suggest now you pause if you need a bit more time. White to play. And the first move is the phenomenal rook to e7. <laughs> or, as the Batman would say, kapow! And this lovely little move is really distracting the Black Queen away from its defense. And this is the first phenomenal tactic. The threat is to take on c7 and also pinning the bishop. So this rook has to be captured. And we've now lost a rook, sacrificed a rook, probably better to say. For what idea? Well, the next idea is the second phenomenal move. Can you see it? Bishop to a6. And the crowd goes wild. And this is a great move because it's all about those light squares. The big threat is queen to b7, checkmate. And the only way to stop that is by capturing the bishop. And now we can see the real point of the rook first diving in. We've moved the queen away from the defense of the corner, allowing the white queen to slide into that position, delivering checkmate. A really short, but I feel beautiful sequence of moves. And I have handpicked all these puzzles from, shall I say, a very large selection of games for their beauty, for their instructiveness, and because they're just damn pretty, right? Damn fine tactics. Again, please like and subscribe to this channel and I'll try and make this a regular thing occurring once a week just to help you improve your tactical vision. We keep them short and snappy.